This guy literally works behind a glass plane. Well, there's really nothing else for me to fucking look at anymore. I think I've expended everything, literally everything. Anyways, hi everyone, welcome back to XCOM. I'm trying my best, I really am. But I think we're gonna stop that little thing now. Excellent. We look forward to seeing your progress. Uh, so, here's how it's going. I feel, I feel this is like an easy experience mission. I'm trying to get Darwal, our Rocketeer here, and my Sniper up to the, the final level. Uh, cause when they're at the final level I can take them on those very hard missions, they can be my A-team. Uh, essentially. Uh, so, but since our other infantry is already maxed out, uh, I'm bringing our our budding infantry along. Also, this sniper has a day left on the the, the waiting li list here, so let, let me just wait for it. Uh, let me see if that will do it. I'm just trying to wait for her to come back. We are confident that you One day. With I don't know. I, I could just reload it. In worst case scenario. 20 alloys. No! The mic has entered, We've gone back to duty. Uh, the mic. This is Mungo Bungo. We look forward to seeing your progress. I, th I think I can't actually do that. Yeah, I think our, our operative just got lost. Oh no, no, still there. Just, like, I have to go, excellent. We look forward to seeing, I could probably do it from the barracks. We are confident that you One day still. Matter with discretion. Yeah. I'm gonna have to deal with it. Oh well. Like, uh, I don't like the fatigue going on, because uh, then I get to, uh, then I lose her for another mission, essentially. So, it kind of sucks, but we're gonna have to deal with it. We are confident that oh well. So, right now I have the Kestrel armor actually on the sniper, and the Kestrel armor is actually what I want to have on the sniper, because she can use that, that hook basically to get up onto high ground. Dropship has arrived. It's probably one of the better things. We're moving to eliminate an exalt cell currently operating within the United States. We'll need to protect our assets in this area in order to secure the necessary intel. Alright everyone, off the fucking plane. Sky Ranger right now. Right. The covert operative we deployed was interrupted by Exalt forces while attempting to gather intel from an Exalt communications relay. If our operative is going to finish the job, Strike One will have to protect them while they hack the remaining arrays. The operative must survive if we have any hope of retrieving that data. Objective updated. Okay, in all likelihood what's going to happen here is she's going to just pop on down here. And then I'll Everybody probably just go up in the middle of one of these. Just hopefully not activating any Exalts. All right, go over here. All right, we didn't activate anybody, so we're in good shape now. Uh, my sniper, where will my sniper go? I also don't want to move these people too far up either. Uh, the sniper, I think, will have the best line of sight down here, so out. she's gonna go right there. Or that's not my sniper at all, it's my rocketeer. Uh, okay, that's not what I wanted. You go back there. Even though you'd be wonderful on that Overwatch, um, you just stayed right there. Ah, here they are. Wow, there's like a ton of them. Oh, nice job. Eight, eight crit. See, he just got his uh, opportunist uh, uh, traits now. Alright, so uh, Rocketeer is going to handle this one. I think I had to put him as far up there as I could. And look, there's another one that even activated. The fucking clusterfuck. Oh, I can take another one though. Target's still up. Nailed him. Alright. Rockets away. Let's blow a hole in that building. That's what the rockets are for. Oh, we only hit two of them. I guess let's go uh, handle this guy. Our operative is ready to hack one of the Exalt relays, Commander. We just have to activate it, and that data will be ours.
Can I? Okay, I'm clicking on it. Hi. You successfully hacked the relay, Commander, while also disrupting Exalt's communication system. We'll need to keep looking for any nearby relays to get the remaining data. I'm gonna do a full crit on this guy. Oh wow, one damage. Uh, I'm opting to, I think, just move up here and then overwatch. Come on, get him. Yeah! Three damage, but he had like a three fucking bonus to, to his his bullshit there. Wow. Alright. Uh, I don't know why the Rocketeers are running the hell away. That's kind of why I want to move my uh, my Overwatcher guy a little bit further away. Commander, we've got a wave of new contacts moving to strike one's position. Okay, fortunately he's not overwatching. That'll be most unfortunate. Yeah, it's got whoever is here is probably gonna have to go. We'll just make sure everybody can make it back in one turn. Okay, yeah, we're good here. Commander, we recovered the last of the data. We just need to get our operative to the evac zone. Once again, it's just received. pulling the fuck out. We can run a gun here too. Might as well. This is why I kind of have it. We're not going to use it in any other case. Well, take a shot. Oh yeah, you got him. Good work. I guess the last shot will go to... Oh, you got double tap again. I guess it's yours. Uh, I guess I'll just rocket these guys and make them panic in their little cover thing so they're not going to do anything. Also, you're probably going to kill that one. Or not. Alright, what's our... Uh, we need him to, to overwatch. And you can just overwatch too. Alright, next turn we're pulling out, so... Unless something goes horribly wrong, we're fine. I mean, they all have to reload. I mean, one guy did try and throw a grenade. I'll give him that. Oh, he just has we ballistics. Contacts moving in, Commander. <laughs> oh, there goes that shot. I'll get him next time. Negative. Oh, oh, I see sniper Overwatch. Dude, that is not how you hold a sniper. God damn it. Her fucking, like, her arm is like, rather than the shoulder taking the recoil, it's the, whatever. I'm even gonna pretend to know what I'm talking about. Excellent work, Commander. The operative and our latest batch of intel are secure. We can have Strike One remain in the area to eliminate any other hostile units, or get them to the evac zone for extraction. We have a new objective. Alright. All right, let's just get everybody in, in there, and let's start taking some shots at people. Uh, let's see. 39, take that one. Ah, oh, you missed. It says that, that one was the, the, the biggest chance he had of, of actually getting a kill. We can try that one then. All right, extract. Alright, I kind of reloaded this one actually because there was a, a very big error I made at the end of the month while well, it was more like a short, short sadness. I want to point out here though that the person that was fatigued for one day is now wounded for nine days. Um, so that's what happens. It just multiplies it. It's as if they took a lot of damage. Alright, we got uh, some money and we got some person back and then we got some Exile other things here. Decryption complete. Eliminating statistical improbabilities for possible... The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. Alright. We're always glad to have more help down here. Next month, I definitely want to make a satellite nexus, except I don't have enough power. Uh, so now I have to make another fission generator. Uh, rip. Yup. And, uh, I don't know how close we are to the end of the month. Uh, I think we can make it. How much would it cost to basically rush it? Because I, I don't want to wait another month, to be perfectly honest.
It would cost 10 melts. So I can't even do it even if I wanted to, which is a shame. All right. So now we're going to scan again for, for things. It's kind of just my whole strategy around that. I, I wanted to really go into that. 15 weapon fragments? Uh, no. I had like 8 for 1, so that was a better deal. All right, we got some alloys back from that. 10 Seeker Rex for 2 Engineers. Not really doing much else with them. Sure, they can have them. All right, we got our uh, biomech research complete, which means uh, we can make a cybernetics lab, mech one warden, advanced surgery project, and uh, mech warfare systems. So this is one of the first mechs we get. I've never played with them, as I said, so I want to get into that soon, but I don't have enough meld right now. Uh, so we have also uh, basically engineering teams proposing a number of, yeah, so they're some kind of upgrade for the mechs. And some surgery, this is a nice one. I think we can adapt some of our aliens' uh, biological research systems uh, into so we can aid the healing of our personnel. So that would be really good. So we don't have these like people out for like a month. And a cybernetic lab to make the, the meld should happen. Uh, and also I'm gonna do cyberdisk uh, wreck first. We've yet to recover one of these in functional condition from the field. The men seem to enjoy using them for target practice. At the present time, we know that the Cyber Disc, as they've been calling it, is heavily armed, but it shows no clear pattern of behavior on the battlefield. They use it for target practice? Seriously? That thing is deadly as fuck. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. It's fucking 300 bucks for a Cybernax lab. The biggest ripoff on the planet. On the entire planet Earth. Alright, uh, so now that she's doing that. Let's go check out our foundry projects. Uh, so, animal conservation is something I want to do eventually, but that's going to take a while before we can get there. It's not that important. Alien surgery. Uh, we have to get stasis tanks and surgery. Wow. And 600 bucks. Jesus Christ. Well, we're not even anywhere close to that. Good thing I haven't been selling those things. Uh, here's something. UFO countermeasures. Uh, we can develop some countermeasures that will make our aircraft slightly harder, uh, significantly harder to hit by alien weaponry. It requires like a seeker wreck and stuff. Interesting. Mech warfare systems is a... Uh, oh, that's $25. For five days, yeah. Well, I, can, I can just wait for that. Proof salvage is not that important. Alright. Well, right now it isn't. So we're just gonna wait now. That's why I kind of want... That, that's, that was a mistake I made before. Uh, panic in India. Uh, it's exalt again. Alright. Uh, let's bring another cobert up out. Uh, we'll bring, let's see, who's our... Well, there's this guy. I think this is our only assault left, but he's he'll be okay. Probably gonna have to make some more, uh, get some more people soon. Not this month, but the next. Alloy plating and a grenade. So, uh, good luck and Godspeed. Alright, let's keep spinning the globe then. Incoming transmission. We are extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Your recent results were beyond our expectations. And that is not a statement this council makes lightly. Alright, I think we're done we all our... In touch, Commander. Uh, we got six days left on a workshop. However, let's look at how long the satellites are going to take to make. Commander. Our current satellite uplink facilities are at full capacity. We should build additional uplinks as soon. Yeah, whatever. We don't. We we know. So it's the first of September. There's I think 30 days in September. Uh, that fission generator is four days off. The workshop is six. So when the workshop is done, we'll make the satellites. When the fission generator is done, we'll make the the other stuff. All right, and autopsy complete. And okay, that's good. Auto sentry turret available for manufacturing, also the Sentinel drone project. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already as we get the floor. I'm out. sure you can make the connection yourself. We've designated this particular specimen as a floater. The research team is continuing in its efforts to determine how the aliens prevented the organic tissue from rejecting the mechanical components, as they seem to work in perfect harmony with one another. All right. And because those are those are really easy to do, I figure there's no reason for me not to do them. There's also that laser can I want to get, but this is why we're going to the America. We're trying to we're trying to invade America. Uh, also, we're probably gonna do like Illyrium next, right after. Just letting you know, because the the power situation is getting pretty dire. I hate to say it. 
Alright. Well, they're autopsy complete. Easy peasy. Uh, oh, wait. Shaped armor? What the fuck? Advanced our own armored shells and cores. Improve our overall design. Interesting. I want to see what that is. Shaped armor. The invaders... Uh, this doesn't really tell me what it does. Also, I, I require a lot of alloys. Oh, it's just for mechanized things. Fuck that. It's dumb. Abductions reported. Commander, we're receiving several urgent <laughs> requests for assistance. Swarming. There are abductions in progress at each marked site on the Hologlobe. I kind of want to. I, I just really want to quickly. I want to. I want to just start building the other thing. So I'm gonna wait for the the other thing to complete building. Fission generator. Power generator complete. Oh no, India's gonna be pissed. Okay, we can't do that then. Fuck that. Sorry. I guess we'll do it when we get back. Next episode, we're not fission generator. I want to build the other thing. Yeah. Uh, rip. Actually, yeah, there's one person that finished it. They, yeah. So Mongo Bungo returned from duty. Uh, so I guess uh, next time we'll, we'll do, uh, in, we'll save India from certain doom, so, uh, well, whatever. Remember, we will be watching.